That is an image that's been floating around Facebook. If you haven't read it already, please do so, so we're on the same page. So, he's a molester of the arts simply because he listens for the beat. This kind of reminds me of a, this kind of hipster attitude reminds me of people that are so anti-establishment that they'll stop listening to a band simply because it became popular. This Facebook image was basically saying, the way I listen to music is more valid than yours. The image, of course, sparked a little debate. The people on their side were trying to say that these people listen to music as a fashion accessory and just jump around from artist to artist based on peer pressure. Well, it can take people a while to develop their own musical taste. I'd like to think that I had my own sense of musical taste all figured out when I was an early teenager, but no, I didn't. It took me until I was probably about 18 to really finally start getting my own sense of uh, my own taste of music. For some people, that comes a little later, like in their late 20s or even sometimes their 30s. Now, granted, there's some people who are 40 and older that still don't have their own sense of music and they just sort of jump around for whatever fad is current and then drop th that, that like of music just because it's no longer in style. Yeah, those people exist, but I don't think that's what this Facebook image was trying to target. We can't hold it against people for finding new music through their friends, their family, or the radio. In this time of smartphones, Facebook, uh, MP3 players, Twitter, all this stuff happens at a much faster rate than ever before. Especially if you're a kid or a young adult, it's natural to gravitate towards the music your friends listen to. Out of the music I listened to as a kid, probably about two-thirds of it I still listen to today. Look, people will eventually come around and eventually develop their own tastes without relying on peer pressure. It'll happen. It just takes time. Making fun of people for it isn't going to make that process happen any quicker. I don't think we should hold this against people. For some people, they may really only listen to it for the beat. Right now. At this time. Now, there is another side to this. I mean, I do find it really sad that music, popular music, has become more simple and redundant over time. Right now, non-standard chord progressions would probably confuse a lot of the audience right now. Music is being dumbed down more and more. And it's sad. There are articles to back that up, too. I'll, I'll try to put them up in the, as a link. But we can't make fun of the people for listening to it. Let's instead make fun of the music itself if we're gonna, if we're gonna make fun of anything. Just like with religion. Don't make fun of the people following the religion. Make fun of the religion itself. It's the only right thing to do if you're going to make fun of anything.